Okay, this video is for anybody who is a little freaked out about uh, setting a mouse trap, and they don't know how to do it, they don't want to hurt themselves, pinch their fingers, whatever, and it can be a nerve-wracking thing, but it is really simple to set up. Um, this is the old school version, um, it's got this metal piece here, there might be, uh, you might have picked up the ones with the plastic piece, the process is really similar. Um, the only difference is this this hook here would be a little different. So you get your mouse trap. This is brand new. Um, pull this out, and there's a little staple here. And this is your um, this is your kind of bar that's going to hold this um, snapping mechanism down. Um, so basically, what you want to do is grab that mechanism. It's on a spring. And I'll just let this go. That's what people are scared of. It is a little nerve-wracking. So what you want to do is hold this down. Start here. Carefully bring this back. Try not to put your fingers anywhere near here. If you hold it on this end, you don't have to worry about getting snapped on. Uh, what I like to do is kind of put this on the floor and just leave it set up where it's going to be. And then take your your kind of bar thing here, and what you want to do, I'll show you here, is you're going to want to hook this in here. And this is really, really, um, it's supposed to be sensitive because you want the mouse to just tap on this, not even barely touch it. So basically, you're just going to hook. Oh boy, <laughs> you're just going to hook this in here just like that and like I said you want to hold it on the ground where you're going to be put this bar underneath and if you just leave it like this the bar is going to fall so you have to add some tension to it so when you hold this up let's see if I can get okay so when you hold this up now you want to relieve just a little bit of pressure off the spring. You need some pressure against that bar and you can let it go. It's pretty simple, but it can be scary. Um, try not to snap your fingers. And we'll just set this off here so we know it works. One mouse caught. And if you're not for the killing of mice, I apologize, but some people need to do this. Unfortunately, they are rodents and they can get into your house and cause all kinds of problems. Um, chew up wires, um, just leave a mess and contaminate insulation and walls and um, just bad stuff. Put holes in the outside of your house. So for those who would like to know how to set one up. I hope this helped. And let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching.